Hello, hello. What's up, guys? I'm gonna ask for Adam's password. I'll be right back. One sec. We got Adam in the building. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Let me just play this so it doesn't. I'm itchy. Ciao, guys. Thank you, sir. I'll see yeah. you later. Yeah, but okay, I love you. Love you. Thanks, after. Okay. There we go. That's better lighting. What's up, guys? How's everyone doing? What up? What up? What up? I'm trying to get some music on this thing. Boom! 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 Hello! 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 Dawson, man. Dawson. You know what, buddy? I've been laughing for a little bit, you know, because you've been chirping. But now I'm getting to the point where I think I got to show you up. You know what I'm saying? Set you down a little bit. But um, that'll be on my schedule. So we'll, uh, I'll let you know. All right? I'll let you know when. Uh, you know when how was your workout today good getting swole not bad not good though like you know i'm not looking like good but the abs are coming in so i'm pumped i got my digitals in like five days so i'm working pretty good looking pretty good i still got to do a workout tonight i do cardio in the morning and then and I do my weights at night. So cardio in the morning, weights at night. Yeah, I'm looking pretty swole. I'll give you a quick look. Like the shoulders are there, the pecs are coming. So I'm not trying to think because I don't got much to show off, but you know, it's a good transformation and like not long. I gotta shave this though. This really doesn't help. But yeah, looking better, looking better. It's been like 17 days, I think, working out. And I'm just feeling better, you know? It's not really for my body as much as it's for me, but the body is a bonus, cause I'm like, you know, I'm a model and stuff, so I gotta look sick as brick. And uh, yeah, so I'm excited for the digitals. Um, I wish I had like another month to do it, but I'll be good. I'll be good. And yeah, it'll be good. But yeah, thank you guys for saying I look great. Thank you. Thank you. But yeah, so cardio in the morning and then I do weights at night. 
Um, and yeah, so I'm looking jacked. This is my little journal. My little journal. Do you want to see what Nervous Will looks like, guys? This is Nervous Will. Whenever I'm on the phone with someone and I'm nervous, I'm like... It's pretty crazy, actually. But like even right now, like live, like I can just talk to you guys and just scribble. But yeah. That's nervous, well. <clears throat> yeah, as much as it's like kind of like weird, I find it cool. Cause it's like, it's me, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I was so like bored on the phone the other day where I was taking like a piece out of the paper. So it looks like it's not written there, but it's actually me like ripping a piece out and I was trying to make checkers. And then I realized that wouldn't actually work. So, yeah. Are you nervous now? I'm not nervous, but I'm a little nervous. Um, because there is something that I need to bring up that I think I'm just gonna get it off right now so we can start the live. Um, I wasn't gonna say this because it's not like a huge deal, you know? Um, and I don't want people to know about it because it's my personal like business and I don't think like I need to say anything, but I've been stressing about this for a little bit. I've been trying to plan it. Um, I wasn't gonna say anything, but the reason why I'm saying something is because um, I notice every month um, when, so just say I would get like, it would be five months no smoking weed. I'd get donations saying, happy five months, right? And I just want everyone to know that I don't want that anymore because I did cheat and I did smoke weed. And I wouldn't say this online because a lot of people aren't smoking weed um, because of me and not doing things because of me. So they, um, I don't want them to stop that grind, but I just want everyone to know that I did cave in a little bit and I was with some buddies and I smoked some marijuana and I know it's not a huge deal but I just don't want people to be sending me donations saying happy six months and then I'm sitting there like but I did smoke so I have to be honest with you guys so no more it's all over we gotta start all over um but at least I'm not smoking weed on a daily and I'm not like addicted to it addicted to the bong and stuff but yeah I did cave in a little bit and yeah for everyone that is not drinking etc keep doing what you're doing um because I was very disappointed in myself when I did cave in um but I wasn't too disappointed because I was like, you know what? Rehab helped, like I got better. I feel better, I'm not addicted to it, you know? And yeah. Did I like it? So I didn't like it that much, um, but I didn't mind it. It was like, it, it was pretty good for me. Like it was like, okay, chill. Um, but yeah, I was just, smelling it around me and I was like you know what just give me one puff so I puffed a joint and yeah that's 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 it um but yeah I just wanted to talk about that quick I don't want people to tell me um everything's okay or everything's not okay I just wanted to put that out there and kind of move on Adam still hasn't touched marijuana which is so awesome for him and I'm there for him for that I never want him to do that because he's on a good grind and he's a very good example um, so shout out to Adam um, but yeah I did cave in so I do not want any um, congratulations for six months or nothing like that I just needed to tell you guys that yeah you know I didn't think there'd be judgment I just you know like I said I just don't want I don't want to lie, you know? I don't want to be sitting there with everyone saying, congratulations, and then I'm like, fuck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Are you starting all over 
yeah, I'm just kind of taking it day by day. Um, like, I'm working on myself, and if I go to a party and I want to, whatever, whatever I want to do, I'll do it. But the biggest thing for me is to stay in control of my life, make sure I'm doing what I have to do, my acting, my workouts, my reading, and not relying on something, a substance. So that's the biggest thing, just trying to keep that up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right, so we got that cleared. I'm happy. Seems like everyone's pretty chill, um, which I'm happy for. Um, I thought it'd be that way. I didn't think it'd be a big deal, but I still had to say something, which I didn't want to say anything, you know? Like, I was like, frick, I haven't been live in a while. And for the first thing for me to say on live is this is kind of like, you know, but it's whatever. Mary, thank you so much. <laughs> All right, anyways, let's switch the subject. Um, And thank you for the whale. And um, how was everyone's Christmas? How's everyone's New Year going? Um, are we gonna make 2023 a great year no matter what? Um, I just bought a book today, so I'm excited. I just bought a book today, and it's called The Power of Now. Um, I was watching on, actually, yeah. So I was watching this video of um, Michael Buble, as we all know Michael Buble. He was um, talking about his life and how he went through so much stuff. And it really related to me. And maybe I'll repost it. Um, but like it really related to me in a way. Um, and then he said what changed his life. One of the things that changed his life was the power now. So I'm going to start the power now. Um, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, it was pretty freaking heart filling. Um, he, um, one thing that he said, which kind of related to me, was he said he was looked at as like that, like, guy that couldn't do wrong almost, and was like a lot of like moms and grandmas loved him because he was you know that sweet guy but he said he had so much like things that like he didn't feel good about like he loved you know like things that whatever like and um so he went through a lot like trying to be perfect and all that stuff um and he was very insecure he'd get really jealous and stuff so held to a higher standard yeah so when i read that i was like when i watched that i was like wow it's pretty cool so I'm going to read that book. It's an audio book, so I don't have to actually read, which is blessed. Um, and I'll just listen to it, you know, before bed. Chill, listen to it. Today in acting, my coach was very pumped up because, so I'm doing a guy that, Thank you for the whale. Uh, Missy, thank you for the hearts. So I am doing, um, like I said before, a guy that um, fell in love. He's about to die. He lost his looks. He has cancer. And he just wants to live his life going on a date. Um, the girl I met that I'm in love with is sick as well. Um, and we see our souls. Um, I lost my leg. And yeah, etc. So what I did was yesterday, we were talking about the story, he said it really good. So what I did is I wrote in like a journal, I wrote like 
how I would write if I was that guy in a journal. So I wrote, life's been pretty hard lately. When I first found out I had cancer, it broke my heart, etc., etc." So I was really feeling like that guy. When I told him today, he was in shock because he was very proud of what I've done. And he said, that's what a natural actor would do. And he didn't tell me to do that. You know, I just kind of did it, which is really cool. Um, so I'm having fun doing it, you know, chilling on my desk, you kind of shut everything out and you write about your life. So it's pretty, pretty awesome. It's a good escape from reality in a way. Um, so yeah, I'm having fun with it. Um, yes, yes, yes. Kate, thank you for the planet. We are number seven. That's beauty. Thank you guys. How's the family? Um, the family's good. My brother has been wanting to like start his own little business. Um, I'm still skeptical about that. I don't know. I think he's still young, but he wants to do that. My sister's doing good. Just, you know, living life, having fun with her friends. Dad's doing good. Dad's doing good. Um, mom's doing good. Grandma's doing good. Canada won the World Juniors. Sorry for the U.S. fans in here, but uh, Connor Bedard, if you know Connor Bedard, lit it up. Um, Connor Bedard's awesome. So it was good seeing Canada win. My grandma was pumped about that. Um, yeah, Bill, my auntie, Adam, we're all good. We're just working hard, trying to make life better and better each day, you know, try not to, yeah, just trying to be good people. That's it. That's all we uh, trying to do. <laughs> Jules, thank you for that. Candy Heart, thank you for the 1,000 2023s. And Tattoo, thank you for the roses. Your TikToks have been awesome lately. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I started seeing like the spark. Thank you. Did you ski? No, I haven't skied yet. I haven't skied yet. Um, like no one wants to go. Getting us to number four, let's go. Love the hoodie, yeah. Can you guys hear me okay? I saw someone say you can't hear. Um, can everyone hear me? Hello, hello, hello. Um, yep, okay, so, yeah, so, as you know, um, Bill, is going to be doing a merch site. Um, we're still talking about that first though because um, we're trying to feel everything out, you know? I don't know um, if I have plans to go to, like we got some things to talk about, but as the plan is right now, we got Bill running a merch store and then we got, I still like my will, like I want Kelly to do it too because I like like both of their ideas, you know? Kelly's got a good, I for like the cool model world that I'm going into. And then um, Bill's got, like he listens to my fans. He listens to the things that I say, like keep moving forward, etc. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of people ask like, which one do we pick? Pick whatever one you guys want. You know, whatever one you guys want. I like both, pick whatever one you guys want. Um, so yeah. Um, we're just trying to, and I'm sorry we've been so wishy-washy, but it's because, you know, like IMG, for an example, is waiting for digitals for me to look amazing. And then like, they have a plan, you know, maybe to send me off to Europe or wherever I go, right? Um, so we've been wishy-washy, like trying to figure out like what image I want to portray, like who I am as a person, who I want to be. So it's been a lot of work, um, especially for me because I have to make decisions, right? I got all these decisions coming at me and then I got to make them. So it's hard, but um, it's good. And I'm learning about myself and I'm sorry that 
you guys have to be through like, oh, we're doing this, now we're not. We're doing this, now we're not, you know? I'm sorry about that. Um, we're gonna try to stay consistent. We'll let you guys know exactly what is going on though. And um, yeah, so first we wanna give our digitals to IMG before we show IMG the website, right? We wanna show them that because IMG is trying to, my model agency wants to see that I want to be a model, of course, right? Like they've been asking for digitals. They wanna see, you know what I'm saying? They wanna see how I, they want to see that I want it, right? So before I send them any website to look at or any of that, just to give, I want to give them what they want and that's uh, my digitals, you know? So just want you guys to know that. Um, that's why we're taking a little long. But um, other than that, digitals are coming up. Um, I think the websites, websites are going to be unreal. Um, IMG has been great with you. On a real note, guys, like IMG, like I'm the most grateful ever for being signed with that agency. Um, my whole life, I cared about like how I look and stuff. So I always wanted to be like that cool model guy, whatever. And um, the president of IMG, um, when he messaged me, and he still messages me, like he messaged me. I'll tell you guys a crazy story. Um, so on New Year's, the night before New Year's, I wanted to message the president of IMG to tell him, thank you for everything you've done, and et cetera, et cetera. So I put it as my screensaver, and take this in, like we haven't talked in forever, like four months, right? So I put it as my screensaver. 10 minutes after I put it as my screensaver, he messaged me saying, happy New Year, let's make this year a great year. Um, let's with all positivity and let's strive for greatness. He messaged me that 10 minutes later. I show Bill. I was like, what the heck? He's like, bro, that is like, that's God. Right. And I was like, wow. Like, I swear guys, like it probably not even 10 minutes later, like five minutes later after I put it as a screensaver and I was so excited. So I told him, I said, I've been, I've been working out for et cetera, et cetera. I'm going to do great. Um, and he's like, all right, all right, all right. Um, he said, I'm excited. I'm excited. So I'm very grateful for that. Um, and yeah, so awesome guy. And I hope I'm going to keep grinding, but I hope this year is a good freaking year. You know what I'm saying? Um, I think we're going to do unreal and yeah. Um, let's hope, you know, let's just keep grinding and see how everything goes. Um, anyway, um, what was I going to say? One sec. I was going to say something. One sec. Um, yeah. So thanks for bringing us. No, thank you for getting me to this point. If it wasn't for you guys right here i would not be signed with a great agency i would not have the opportunities i have to be paying big bucks for acting classes and that's why it's not the only reason why i want to do really good like i want to do for myself of course but you guys are a part of that you guys have done that so you guys are a part of why i want to do good um you guys are on my mind more than you might think you know um but yo i think we're gonna have a really sick year and for everything um and yeah so this is the shirt that we're thinking of making it's my favorite shirt it says keep moving forward right here and then right here so let's keep moving forward and i like how the lines are like moving but yeah, it's my keep moving forward shirt. I just like the saying, keep moving forward. Um, I was talking to like my aunt and everyone. And uh, I was like, with all this anxiety that I have, right? Which we all have, I'm not saying it's just me, but how do I like get through it? Because sometimes it feels crippling, right? Where it's like, I don't want to do anything, right? So I was thinking about it. I'm like, yo, I got to keep moving forward. 
Like, I got to keep moving forward, like, no matter what. Like, if someone is telling me, like, if the worst things are happening, I have to keep moving forward and know that I am going to do something good today. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I said keep moving forward. And I had it as my screensaver, right? So I had it as my screensaver. And then Bill's like, we should use that as a quote for the merch. And I'm like, we should. That's awesome. So yeah, keep moving forward is uh, that's how we came up with it. Um, yeah. been so missed thank you guys i got 10 percent um we're gonna probably stay on for another five ten minutes um and then i'm gonna go eat some spaghetti and meat sauce my favorite meal and then i'm just gonna chill for a little bit it's my chill time Woo! time to chill you know i worked really hard today i worked out i did my acting I did my live, um, took a nice cold shower. It's also been 17 days freezing cold showers. I take a little bit of a hot shower at the beginning. And then I'm going to do another workout. Have you seen any good movies lately? I have seen some movies, but I'm trying to think of like a good one I've seen lately. I can't think of one. Just like random movies, you know? Why cold showers? So we're number one, by the way. Thank you guys for that. Um, why cold showers? Like, so when I take cold showers, I heard it's really good for your brain, good for OCD, good for anxiety, all that stuff. So I was like, why not try it, right? And I can see for some reason why. That Thank you. Um, so I can see why it does that. Cause I don't know why it just kind of wakes you up. Like you're like sitting in that cold shower and you're like, <gasps> and then as you're like freezing cold and everything's happening, all this pressure, you got to breathe. So you're like, <gasps> <gasps> so it teaches you to be strong. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? So little things like that, added cold showers, um, focus. Yeah. Focus. And so started doing that. Um, yeah. Burr, no thanks. Yo, honestly, like, if you don't want to do it, don't do it. Like, what I'm trying to say by that is, like, if you're good with your hot showers and you love to just, like, you're a anxiety-free mother effer, you know? Yo, keep being that person. Don't be that crazy guy that's jumping in cold showers. But for me, I kind of need to do crazy things to, like, keep going. You know what I'm saying? Hey, thank you for the 2023. Thank you, thank you. Ice baths are the new vibe. Ice baths are the new vibe. I see a lot of people doing that. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. It's okay. You'll be good. Um, yeah. So have you ever flown a drone? No, I haven't. Do I have interest in flying a drone? Not really. Not really, to be honest. Um, I don't know. You know, you fly it in the air. Yay, there it goes. I don't know, it's not it's not really the vibe. Like it's like Yeah, I don't know. Fuck. Rather fly a plane. Um 
word of the day. I think the word of the day, I always say enjoy. It's the first thing that comes to my mind because I just want to enjoy. But I would say, yeah, enjoy. Let's start it off with enjoy. Rather drive a Lambo. Yeah, I'd rather drive a Lambo than a drone. I think we all would, though. But no, like drones are good for good footage. You know, you can get sick footage and stuff, 100%. But yeah, I've never been interested in it, no. I'm scared of driving a Lambo. I'm scared of driving a Lambo too. At first, like, Josh would ask me, like, do you want to drive the Lambo? And I would say no, because I'm like, bro, like if I crash that or something, um, like you step on the gas and you're flying, you know what I'm saying? Um, but not now I would do it for sure. I'm not, bring it. Yeah, literally let a girl. Me for speed. You look fabulous, thank you. Haircut for digitals, I'm not too sure. So I got six days left till digitals. Uh, today's the sixth, right? Or seventh, I think it's the seventh. Um, five days. I'm gonna work out for the next like four days and then I'm gonna take one break, um, a day break, let my muscles get pumped and then go in for that. So it's gonna be really good. Um, I don't know what they're doing with my hair. Not too sure. Um, but you know what? I'm not too worried. All I know is that I'm working out. So if these digitals aren't perfect in a month, they will be. Or in two months, they will be. Because I'm not stopping working out. I don't care. Anything happens, I'm still working out because it's making me feel good. And I really want to see how good I can do. Thanks, Auntie. How good I can do in two months. Like imagine in two months I lift my shirt up and it's just like, I don't even have to flex. It's just, who doesn't want that, you know? So I'm gonna grind for that. And I'm just feeling like bigger and better. And by summer, I'm gonna be ripped i've been telling adam to work out he hasn't really done it lately but he's on his own you know you'll do it when you're ready you know what i'm saying so i'm giving him his thing um but i'm telling you guys for people that want to be motivated start working out even if it's like 15 minutes on the treadmill for like a week you're gonna start feeling so much better um and now i'm addicted now i'm addicted like I have to do it. Am I dreading the workout tonight? Yes. I am dreading the workout tonight. I'm gonna, I wanna eat, I wanna watch a movie, I wanna chill. But am I gonna do it? 100%, 100%. So. To be honest, it does make it a little easier when like Bill has a gym in his house. So I can just take off my shirt, crank music, do whatever I want, take pictures. I can stay down there for like two hours, you know what I'm saying? Two hours like isn't over exaggerate, you know, but like an hour, an hour and a half. Um, but yeah, it's pretty awesome and I'm gonna keep doing it. Anyway, let's stop talking about that. You're looking amazing. Thank you, guys. Now I want to see you. I'm looking pretty good. Oh, but it's still, like, not there. But the chest and stuff, like, got way bigger. Where's the gym? That way? Jeez. See, look, if I'm sitting here, 
I want it to be six pack. <laughs> Sound like such a gym rat. I suggest, someone said, I suggest you for James Bond today. I suggest you for James Bond today. Should I watch that? Smoking hot. All right, it's looking all right, guys, but we can't be too pumped because it's not there yet. I'm still looking and I'm like, you know, so it's coming, it's coming, but it's not there yet. But it will be, but it will be. We are celebrating your birthday in Vegas. That is so cool. Have fun. Are you doing push-ups or crunches? So this is my workout, ready? So I go on the, the machine, right? Put your feet in it and you go. So there's a mirror this way, mirror that way. So I can see like the side and everything, right? And I can like look, practice my faces, my stare, like Zoolander, right? So I'm ripping like Zoolander on the optical. And then after the optical, so this is what I used to do. Now I switched it up. I do the optical in the morning for 15 to 20 minutes, hardcore. And then I, and then I do my weights at night. But before, like two days ago, I would do the optical, or whatever it's called, elliptical, elliptical, the popsicle, whatever, and I'm ripping it. And then I would go get off that, grab the bow flex machine. So there's the bow flex. And I would do this, I would do this, and then I go this, or no, this, and then I go this. All with cables, it's all with cables, right? And then this for the bicep, I mean for the triceps. And then after all that, I go on the ground, grab the ab roller, and I go, and I pull out, and then I go to the side for the side abs. And that's it for the weights. And then as soon as I get better and better after a couple months, a month, I'll start adding stuff, you know, maybe go for 15 or 10 K runs one day, you know, I'll just be mucking four hour workouts like Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <sighs> yeah. So yeah. Are you eating different? Yeah, I'm eating a lot of tuna, sardines, eggs, sometimes pasta, and chicken and rice mostly with salad. All right, guys, I'm having so much fun on this live. I really am. I could talk for a while, but I'm going to go downstairs and eat. My phone's about to die too, you know, I'm going to chill. For a bit um i know i know it's sad um i want to thank you guys though so much for coming in my phone might die right now just so everyone knows it might die right now if it dies that's it um thank you guys for coming in again um i'll let you know how to do that. Um, and yeah let's make 2023 a great year i hope everyone's feeling great also just so everyone knows i don't answer dms um 
once in a while, snoop around like a couple, but I try to stay off social media as much as I can unless I'm on live or making videos because it's a lot for me sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Um, don't take it personally. Obviously, I know most of you don't, but the odd person might be like, what the heck? Why, don't, why doesn't he like my stuff? Don't take it personally. I love you guys. Thank you so much for everything. And uh, yeah, enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you for making my night better because I was super anxious today, but I still did all my stuff super anxious. So that for you guys proves that no matter how anxious, depressed, whatever you are, get through it, push through it, and you never know. Maybe at the end of the day, you'll feel better. So thank you for making me feel better. Um, yeah, love you. All right, I guess this is goodbye. Goodbye, guys. By the way, I think we're gonna be dropping these two. Um, but yeah, this is my guy. This is my guy. He's my bear. We're matching t-shirts. He's my boy. Someone said no kiss. Guys, listen, before I go, I just find like kissing cheesy. Like if I'm like, bye, Mwah. I just find that cheesy. I don't know why, but I do, all right? I used to do it. You move on from things, all right? Nothing personal, frick. So get over it, all right? Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, guys. We love it. I don't love it. I, me, don't love it. All right? Look at me. Yeah, I'm being a... No, I'm just joking. But I'm not joking. So, um, let's have a good night. Let's enjoy our night. Thank you for coming in. And, uh, bye. There you go. Bye, guys. Oh.